Hello, I'm Raymond Garth, I'm the Philippine Consul to Ireland. I'm here in the Bayanihan village of Ten Foundation, and I'm here with Ian Campbell, the founder and uh, general manager of the Ten Foundation. Ten Foundation has just completed a voluntary audit by myself of their working conditions, and the, their accounts, and all of their financial transactions. Um, this is a voluntary uh, program set up for charities based in Ireland that have a significant foothold in the Philippines. So I've spent the last number of hours going through the, the accounts, the SSS payment, the PhilHealth programs and the scholarship programs set up by Ian's 10 Foundation for their, for their workers and staff. Uh, Ian, would you like to just tell a little bit about the program that you have here? Uh, thank you Raymond and, and welcome to uh, Ten Foundations here at Pioneer Village. We're a, a charity that I set up in 2012 and we were lucky enough to, to get a donation of £10,000 from Ashfield Girls School in East Belfast and we were able to buy this bit of land and uh, this is our headquarters here and we have our livelihood programme where women, local women who are, are living in, in pretty terrible poverty or they were uh, with most of them no education, no skill, and they come here to work every day uh, and make school bags, which we then sell in Ireland, um, mainly to primary schools. That's a big part of our, our income now, as well as uh, donations from people. So it's it's a pleasure to, to have Raymond here and um, tell you guys a wee bit about, about what we're doing here in the, the Philippines. So you're a registered charity in Northern Ireland? Yes, we're, we're and registered. Are you currently meeting all the, the regulatory requirements in Northern Ireland? Yes, we are. So you've retained your charity number year after year? Yes, since yes, so. yes. We're, we're a registered charity with the Northern Ireland Charity Commission and we have been since uh, it was set up, actually, I think in about 2013. So, yeah. so one of the reasons I came here today was to enhance that charity status. So because the charity status in Northern Ireland and the Republic of Ireland is so strong and rigorous, people feel confident when they're dealing with a registered charity. When you then send the money abroad, there's always a question, what's happening to the money here? And that's why I came here today. As the Philippine Consul to Ireland, I came here to conduct an audit of um, the, the whole premises, from um, interviewing the workers, uh, listening to their backstories, more of which videos will be shared of them. Um, in, in the coming hours or, or days, um, but really to really check exactly what's happening. So what I can say as the, as the Philippine Consul to Ireland, I can testify and put my hand on my heart to say that every cent that comes into this organization is spent on the staff and the enhancing the premises here. Um, I, I made the mistake a number of times when I was talking to Ian, I was calling it a resort and he's saying it's a village, it's not quite a resort. For me it's a resort. It's, it's a huge property, 4,000 square meters. They have about 20 staff being employed. By extension, you have other employees supplying services to um, to the town foundations, GP drivers, Tracy Cat drivers, and local Sari Sari stores. So by purchasing a bag from town foundation in the Belfast shop in Northern Ireland or in the Philippine Embassy outreach missions, which they'll be part of going forward for the next year, and there'll be bags for sale. By purchasing a bag there, the money goes directly to the women here, um, and it is all women um, that's employed here. Women that have got their basic training to now become very skillful uh, seamstresses and bag makers. So by purchasing a bag here, you're sending the money direct to those people. You're creating employment and spin-off employment in the local economy as well. So I'm calling on all Filipino all Filipinos, all people of Filipino origin, to help your Cabo by supporting this very, very worthwhile, worthwhile organization um, by purchasing. You can get bags through 10foundation.org, you can visit the Belfast shop, or you can come along to the Philippine Embassy Outreach Missions over the next year and there will be 10 Foundation bags for sale. Thank you. Thank Thanks you. Thank you. Thank you very much.